guys, welcome back to my channel. All right, so today's video, I'm going to be using Kinky Curly products for my wash and go styling, and I just trimmed my hair. If you guys, I did a video on that, so if you've not watched it, there's going to be a link that's gonna pop up. Just click on that link to see how I trimmed my hair. But yeah, so let's get into the styling, and today I'm gonna to be using a shingling method. So I have done a um, product review on Kinky Curly, um, but for that video, I've done that video, but I did that using the raking method for my styling anyways. I use the raking method to style my hair with their products. So this time around, I'm gonna be doing shingling, and we're going to see how it turns out. All right, so just stick with me if you'd like to see the outcome. And before we go ahead, I'm going to just show you the products. Um, so this is the Not Today from Kinky Curly. The, this acts as a detangler as well as a leave-in conditioner, so I'm going to be using that. And I'm going to be using the Kinky Curly Curling Custard. This is what it looks like. And uh, also, I do have my coconut oil. It's just a coconut oil that I have in my kitchen. So use whatever coconut um, oil that you currently have or what you use, any oils that you use. And I have water in a spray bottle. Now I put a little bit of glycerin in this as well. Glycerin is a humectant. It helps with uh, attracting moisture. It's a it's a good to it's a good uh, product to use um, during winter, during dry season. If you're experiencing that your hair is not holding in that moisture, or if your hair is a little bit dry than normal, glycerin is a go-to for me, anyways. So that I do have here. I do have my and I do have my rubber bands. And um, I do have my comb. All right, guys. So let's get into the video.
hair currently looks like after the styling. Um, it looks quite short, considerably shorter. Um, that's because, as I mentioned earlier in the video, I had done a trim and it was quite a big of a trim because I had a lot of split ends, so I had to get rid of those. So it was a big chop. <clears throat> and also shrinkage as well has a part in this, but mainly because of the trim. If you've not watched the video once again, just click and go to my videos. Uh, you find the uh, uh, video of trimming my hair. Go watch it. All right, guys, so this is what I ended up with. Um, with using kinky curly and shingling. All right, so I'm gonna come closer so you guys can see exactly what it looks like. All right, there you go. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know your thoughts. If you've used Kinky Curly before and you've done it with a shingling method and you got a different result or you did something different that helped the curl pattern even further define, please let me know. Share with the girl. All right. Um, thank you guys for watching again and for stopping by. Please like, subscribe, and share the video. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Take care, guys. Oh, 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 oh,